Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Let's get started on project number one. I'm using a pair of these Stella candles and I'm removing the plastic from both of them. I purchased these mirror tiles a while back from Amazon and all I'm doing is placing a strip around the top of both candles. The plastic left a sticky residue on the candles and I'm just using that part as the back side. These mirror tiles are self-adhesive but you can add a stronger adhesive if you want these to last over time. For this next step, I'm gluing this candle holder and also the two candles on top of my 4x5 inch mirror. As I always mention, if you are going to recreate any of my projects, please use a stronger adhesive so your projects can last over time. I'm gluing these clear acrylic gems around the border of my mirror. I put these mirrors together like this for a previous project that I did and I'm reusing these for this project. I'm cutting strips of these mirror tiles to place around the borders of my mirrors. I'm being real careful when cutting these because these are real glass and I do not want to damage them. I'm making sure I fold it in half all the way, separating the mirror tiles so it can be easier for me to cut it. I'm only putting glue on the areas that will touch the candles. Now I'm going to fill the center candle holder with these clear gems and also these pink gems that I purchased from Amazon a while back. All items from Amazon will be linked below in my description box. How stunning is this project? Let me know what y'all think down in the comments. On to the next one, I'm using four of these 4x4 four four inch photo frames that I purchased from Dollar Tree. I'm removing all the backing and the tabs from each frame. Thank you. 
I'm using a piece of foam board to seal the bottom. I'm only placing these strips on the front side and also the top. I'm filling my box up with these gems. I also decided to add some of these gems. I picked this LED puck light up from the Dollar Tree a few weeks back. It comes with a remote and all I'm going to do is stick it right in the center of my box. How pretty did this turn out? Let me know what y'all think down in the comments. For this last and final project, I'm using this clear vase and more of those glass gems. All I'm doing is gluing the gems around the entire vase. I'm leaving a small space in between each gem. I'm adding more of those magnolia flowers and I'm bending them to make them fit to my liking. Well, that was quick and easy and it turned out very beautiful. Let me know down in the comments which project is your favorite for this week.